Hey, K-pop fans, love is in the air, and with Valentine's Day today, I wanted to take a look at a handful of K-pop idols doing the unthinkable and finding love outside of their K-pop community. While you would think this is a normal occurrence, idols dating and marrying is almost taboo in the K-pop world, and many idols keep the relationships a secret. I've always thought it was unfair to the idols to expect them to reject love and romance and in favor of the fandom. And I hope this will shed more light on this topic. And hopefully soon, it will be more acceptable to think of our idols as people who can look for whatever they want without being vilified for it. With that being said, there are idols who don't present the news that well. And then there are also fans who don't handle it that well either, you know, as you'll see. I only plan to go over 10 couples for today's video, but just know that there's a good handful of inspiring love stories in the K-pop world. And so, without further ado, let's get started with this list. One piece of good advice is that it's best not to date your co-workers, but Taeyong doesn't seem to have heard that one. On the set of his music video for 1AM in 2014, he met actress Min Hyorin, and the two instantly developed feelings for each other. Even though Taeyong had never been in a relationship before, he fell head over heels for her. He wrote powerful love songs like Eyes, Nose, Lips for her, and the couple eventually married on February 3rd, 2018, after four years of dating. The two are still going strong. On episodes of Korean talk show Hello and Strong Heart in December of 2011, former Wonder Girls' leader Sunye divulged that she was seeing a man that she met through her volunteer work, a Korean-Canadian named James Park. The two had become more acquainted by email, and in January of 2013, JYP Entertainment confirmed that Sunye would be halting her promotions to spend more time with James, and the two were married shortly after. This upset fans because as the leader of the Wonder Girls, they felt that she had a greater duty to the group than other members. Sunye gave birth to their first daughter in October of that year, and the couple moved to Haiti in early 2014 to do missionary work, where they stayed for two and a half years. Despite multiple denials by her label for her leaving her group, Sunye officially departed in 2015. Sunye gave birth to two more daughters in the following years and made her return to Korea with her family and the entertainment industry in 2018 under Polaris Entertainment. In a handwritten statement in June of 2020, TVXQ's Changmin revealed his engagement to his non-celebrity girlfriend, who he had been dating since December 2019. The couple was married in October of 2020 in a private ceremony, and SM released a statement assuring that Changmin will continue to promote as a member of TVXQ and to please send your congratulations toward Changmin, awaiting a new beginning in his life. Love was in the air inside Cube Entertainment when Hyuna and Idan became acquainted. Their label performed the trio Triple H in May of 2017 by putting their star Hyuna with Pentagon members Idon and Hui. It turns out that the pair had been dating for a year before that, and after rumors circulated that Hyuna and Idon were dating, they took to Instagram and confirmed the reports. Cube effectively terminated Hyuna and Idon's contracts during the promotions for their second Triple H EP, saying they could no longer quote unquote trust the couple. The couple moved on to Sai's new label, P Nation, so they could continue to make sweet music together. Idon now goes by Don, and the two showcased their love almost daily on their Instagram accounts, proving that love can survive the pressures of K-pop stardom. In another example of dating a fellow idol in September 2017, FT Island's label FNC confirmed that the band's drummer Minhwan was dating Laboom member Yul Hee. NH Media terminated Yulhi's contract on November 3rd, 2017, and the couple announced their engagement three months later. A few months after that, in May of 2018, the couple announced that Yulhi was pregnant. Their son Jayul was born a little over a week later on May 18, 2018, and the couple was married later that fall. Throughout their journey as a couple, they joined the second season of Mr. House Husband before welcoming their twin daughters on February 11, 2020. Minhwan is in his military service and is expected to be released in September 2021, but luckily as the service allows him to commute home to take care of his family with Yulhi.
On December 13, 2014, Super Junior Sungmin privately married actress Kim Saeun after they confirmed in September that they had been dating. Some fans were upset at the entire ordeal and many rumors related to the new couple spread. Rumors such as Sungmin choosing his wedding date in the middle of their Super Show rehearsals going against the members and fans' wishes. However, this one, for example, was debunked when Sungmin and Seon recently revealed that SM, in fact, chose the date that would best align with Super Junior's schedule. It's important to understand that it's quite difficult maintaining a secret relationship under the public eye and be ready to come out with the news when the time is right. Sungmin and Sao never got the chance to share their story and side on their time, and as a result, the many malicious rumors continued to circulate for years. When it was announced that Super Junior would be having an eight-member comeback after two years in the fall of 2017, fans protested to have Sungmin kicked out of the group, and they threatened to boycott Super Junior until they did so. Sad to say that Sungmin has been inactive from Super Junior since early 2015. He's still technically a member of the group and under contract with the company. He and his wife share their life through their Instagram posts and his YouTube channel Sungmin's Liu Studio and her YouTube channel Shantoki Saun. In another industry surprise, former Wonder Girls' member Lim revealed in May 2020 that she had been in a seven-year relationship with her non-celebrity boyfriend, Taekwondo athlete Shin Min Chol. The two were married just a few months later on July 5th, and several of her former members and label mates were witnesses. Veteran K-pop idol Hee Joon of H.O.T. began dating crayon pop So Yul in 2016. And after just three months in November, they announced their engagement. The two were married in February of 2017, and their daughter was born on May 12th of that same year. Soyo withdrew from Crayon Pop to focus on her new family. Fans on both sides were upset at the fact that the two denied they were getting married because of a pregnancy. But the timing of the engagement, wedding, and birth of their child were undeniable. The fans begrudgingly accepted reality, though, and they still got to enjoy the happy family together through the show The Return of the Superman. <laughs> Chen of EXO shocked fans when he announced that he was going to be getting married and that his fiance and longtime secret girlfriend was also pregnant with his child. She gave birth to his daughter just three months later in April 2020, and Chen had professed his love for her in his letter to fans. Fans were divided, with many being happy for the star starting a new family, while other fans had called for a boycott to the group, asking him to be removed from EXO. And despite the petitions, Chen is still with EXO as of February 2021, and so his fans will have to deal with the fact that he is now off the market. Another celebrity power couple in the Korean entertainment industry is definitely Rain and Kim Tae-hee. They are a true power couple with a combined net worth estimated over 50 million US dollars, which is incredible for Korean entertainers. Despite the riches, the two live modest lives and married in 2017 in a wedding that cost only 1600 US dollars. Rain converted to Catholicism for Tehi in 2014 and dated for five years before tying the knot in January of 2017. They now have two children. Their first daughter was born in October of 2017, and the second was born in September of 2019. Rain and Tehi are regarded as one of the most beautiful couples in the industry, so we know that they made some damn beautiful babies. Mm -hmm. Hey everyone, this is a great time for you to show your appreciation to the people in life that you care about, whether it's your K-pop stands or even your friends and family. We all like to know that we're cared about and for one day a year, let's show each other some love. Thank you all so much for watching. Hope you all enjoyed this and found it inspiring. Please be sure to hit those like and subscribe buttons for me. And while you're here, check out many more of my videos and see you next time.